Shit, guys, I didn't put out a video last week. Um, it just bypassed me, and this weekend I was sick. But in any case, uh, I'm gonna get this one out. So last week I was actually quite busy going to like some startup meetings and um, really trying to get into the startup scene and into that. And I was reading this book, Lean Startup from Eric Reese, Rice. Um, Race? Eric, from Eric. I was reading this book from Eric. Um, I finished it and uh, last week tied in well with, with the contents of this book. Because this is a cool book. Um, it's all about a startup and where they go wrong, what you can do that's right, and some guidelines and content for you guys to think about for, for your company. But you can even take it further out than that. You don't need to have a company to like learn the principles that are in this book. So a lot of the principles in this book is about almost doing the minimum amount of work for the maximum amount of, of, of data or feedback. Three parts of the book, guys. Vision, steer, and accelerate. Vision just gives you a breakdown of um, what an entrepreneur is, what a startup is, how it came to be where it is now through entrepreneurial management. Kind of looks at old school management as well. Um, steer is kind of taking that second step is once you have an understanding of um, startups how do you now um, create a successful one right so how do you steer the ship and accelerate is once you're in the right ship once you're going in the right direction how do you grow that and how do you keep innovating so it's kind of like introduction of startups running them well and growing them faster and faster. Um, I really dig the book guys. It wasn't that quick of a read. Um, and a lot of the stuff is, I kind of already know it. I already do a lot of these things. They speak about like agile management practices. They introduced the Toyota way and how Toyota brought about this whole agile um, work methodology with just in time inventory and stuff. So if you know business or if you've been doing comp like IT, managing projects these a lot of these things are kind of um, familiar to you uh, what what is interesting though is even though I do this every day this agile stuff um, I still learned a lot because a big part of this book is he's like feedback loop that he introduces so you can check this out I don't know can you see that you can see that so it's kind of build measure learn so you have this idea you build it as fast as you can you put it into a product, you measure the, the response of that product or service, um, you get data, you learn from that data, and you can carry on with that loop. Again, started idea, build, product, measure, <sighs> data, and learn. Guys, I don't even know this, uh, this feedback loop, but it's actually just learn, um, build, measure, and learn. And it's very cool because he like kind of tries to bring you into the thinking of um, thinking of the scientific method. So it's really trying to, um, brings, he brings in this concept called validated learning. And like we learn all the time, but we don't know if what we're learning is like good quality, bad quality, if it's signal noise, um, if it's meaningful or not. And a lot of things that we probably learn, we think are meaningful and then they're actually not. So this idea of validated learning is kind of saying, how do we test something for, and get a predictably and statistically accurate result that they can use that data to then uh, make better decisions. So I don't know how I'm going to implement this with my team. It's an interesting question. Maybe I'll get back to you guys on that. Um, but yeah, guys, get the book. It's cool. Validated learning is a good idea. Um, no. We don't even know what we're saying anymore in this book review, guys. Um, yeah, guys, Lean Startup, it's a book about um, creating a startup that works well, that um, has valuable ideas, that finds product market fit, and that uses agile management practices to continuously improve and innovate and deliver and execute. Um, and that's about the book, guys. That's it. That's all that you need to know. You can go get it if you're in a startup. If you're not and you're doing IT and you're doing like project management, where you hear the words agile or you hear the words waterfall. Waterfall is the old management practice. Um, you should uh, get this book just so that you can see how 
um, a management practice that's created by Toyota long ago is applicable to today and it, it helps um, deliver like very well executed plans. So it could help you um, there even if you're not in a startup game. Anyways guys, I'll see you in like another couple days. I'm on this 90 day challenge thing. Luckily making a YouTube video every week is not on that challenge otherwise I would have forgotten all about it. Um, but exercise twice a day, meditate every day. Uh, two cold showers every day, but they're just at the end of the day. Um, there's a progress picture and a couple other things that I'm doing. Um, that stuff is all going really well, so I'm happy with it. I have no power here, guys. I don't know what's going on. So I don't know when I'm going to edit this video. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Things are going well on my side. I'll keep posting videos. Maybe I'll do some more, like we'll interview some guys from startups. I met some very cool startup companies this past week. This one called FinChatBot. Um, they're like a chatbot for the financial services industry, which is what I'm involved in. So it was kind of it's intriguing. Um, and I think we can just start doing some more content for companies here. Cheers, guys. Ah, ah. Like, comment, subscribe, all that bullshit and um, some valuable resources in the description, maybe. <laughs> Three parts of this book, guys. Um, vision, steer, and accelerate. So vision just gives you the background of what... Um... Oh, fuck. <laughs> Three parts of this book, guys. Um, vision, steer, and accelerate. Vision just tells you about the history of startups, how they've kind of come to party and play now and um, um, three three parts in this book guys uh, vision steer and accelerate first part introduces you to startups or you're an entrepreneur um, how entrepreneurial management um, moved its way into like this entrepreneurial ah, fuck. <sighs> three parts of the book all right um, vision, steer, and accelerate. And the idea is part one is kind of introducing you to the whole entrepreneurial landscape that we're in and startups and kind of how startups are in thing now and it started from, fuck no, that's terrible.